I think the most profound personal impacts are a sense of shame, growing up with a sense of shame, as shame as your second skin. Uh, of being conscious that things in your home were very different to the way they were in the homes of your friends um, and of wanting to hide. And the other big impact is grief. And that's something that comes back to me more and more as I get older, is looking back on childhood and reflecting on what might have been instead of what was. Um, and, a, and a deep sense of sorrow for that. And also sorrow for those, not just those of us who have experienced parental misuse of alcohol, but for the parents who were lost to alcohol. I think that's the, they're the, the preeminent uh, emotions um, that I take with me out of that whole experience. I think the key to me was actually coming to terms with my own misuse of alcohol uh, and seeking help through uh, rehab, through counselling, um, through the help of a very good programme, uh, which is part of my life to this day. Um, and so in, in looking at myself, I was able to look back at the experiences of childhood and to realise, I think the critical thing is that no parent who is, who is trapped in alcoholism is willfully setting out to harm you. It's just this, this disease that spreads around it, chaos and shame, and, and as I said, grief, huge grief for generations.